testing out a 2023 Supreme S240. Me and Matt are gonna start setting up profiles because it's very versatile. Uh, great wakeboard wake, uh, great incredible surf wave, along with a great rough water ride that Supreme and Centurion is known for. Custom order, like I said, so it's uh, custom colors, custom options. Uh, they chose with the Wet Sounds Champ package, uh, the Skyline board racks, which are incredible. The S240 has a lot of uh, storage. As you can see on this hinge seat here, uh, all the ballast here is subfloor, so you have plenty of room. It's all continuous. Um, great room out the back, complete sun pad with a mid walkthrough in the very back off the transom. Uh, there is rear storage in the very back here. Uh, with drains, they can be anything from a cooler, uh, flip-flops, ropes, or anything in between. So right now, uh, we're going to start filling ballast. Uh, like I said, uh, set up his profile so he's ready to go on delivery. Just keep things simple. It's a very uh, push profile, activate and go. Uh, not a lot of extra things needed. That's the awesome things about these uh, Supremes. A lot of boats in this segment, you got to add weight. You got to add a lot of extra uh, suck gates on the side. This is, this is ready to set up out of the box and go. Another good thing about the uh, Supreme, it's got a digital dash along with some analog accents to your right. But the best thing about it is it's simple. So go here, this little guy here. This is all your profiles. We're gonna press Pro Surf left in this case, activate and go. Matt's already got it activated, so that's gonna adjust your surf tabs, stinger plate, ballast, speed. So now all he, Matt has to do now that the ballast is full, throttle and go that's an incredible wave outside the box there's no extra uh steel shot we're going 11.4 miles an hour and on the dot com we're burning right at eight gallons an hour which is pretty low so right now we're dropping the stinger plate a little bit we're going to elongate the wave Another great thing with the Silent Stinger, which is the exhaust for this Supreme, it keeps it quiet. I'm just sitting here talking to you, and I'm not yelling. So right now, Matt's got the Stinger plate down to about 50 to 60. We added about an extra three to four feet of usable surf wave. I and mean, that's a class leading wave right there. Another great thing about the Supreme brands is that I have incredible visibility. I, yes, I have my bolster seat up. I'm still looking through the windshield. My wife can easily see through this position without standing up. I don't need any seat risers. Uh, I don't have any fancy tricks going on. My stinger plate's only at 55 right now. And if you look back, the wave is still incredible. You know, we're in a 24 foot boat with no extra steel shot, out of the box, profile and go, make an incredible wave and great visibility. I don't know of any other boat in this segment that can do that. All right, so now we've done the surf wave, got that dialed in on both sides, so surf left and surf right. Uh, now it's gonna dial on the wakeboard wake. Most times the factory settings are very close, which is great. So right now, um, we're gonna try to dial on this wakeboard wake at about 20 miles an hour, 20 and a half. Uh, that's kind of the average speed of most people wakeboard at. Right now we have the ballast. Set up from the factory setting, uh, we've got 100% in the rear, 100% in the subfloor, and about half in our front. Uh, I'm going to start with my stinger plate uh, most of the way down so it's easy to plane out. Uh, like I said, 20 and a half miles an hour is where I'm going to start, and uh, we'll see where it's at. This is one of my personal favorite models from Supreme because it's very versatile. Uh, great wakeboard wake, uh, great incredible surf wave, along with a great rough water ride that Supreme and Centurion is known for. So if you like what you see, please subscribe to the channel and click the bell on top left to uh, subscribe as we upload videos weekly.